So you might be in a position where for some reason your websites are not loading on your internet browser on your iPhone. Now usually you might be using Safari, so you might be getting a pop-up like this, where it says Safari cannot open the website, whatever. Now the reason why this may be happening is because you're having an internet connection problem or your specific application is kind of glitching up or the website you're typing in isn't properly connected to or it's not a real website. So the first thing and the most popular reason why is maybe you're not on Wi-Fi or you're not on cellular. So if you look right here, if I look on the top right, it doesn't really look like I'm connected to Wi-Fi. If I go and swipe down, you can see that I have my Wi-Fi panel right there. So all I have to do is go and enable Wi-Fi. I can go back here and you can see that my Wi-Fi will then be connected. And I can go ahead and refresh this page just like this and you will see it'll work. And that is all you have to do. Check your internet connection, check your Wi-Fi connection, and just check your data and just see that you are actually connected to Signal. Sometimes there's tons of times, like right here with Wi-Fi and cellular, there's a lot of times where you might just go ahead and think you're connected to Wi-Fi, but you may not be. There's times where you might be like in the basement of somewhere, you might be like on a highway going to a random place, and sometimes that may not be able to be good enough signal for you to actually go and actually be connected to it. So in my opinion, that is another big, massive thing that can cause some issues. Now, let's say you do that and that doesn't seem to be the issue. Well, the next thing I would recommend doing is going through and just restarting your phone. So go through, if you can verify that you're connected to Wi-Fi and everything, just go ahead and if your other apps are working too, go into your app store, load up some other apps. If everything else is working, all you have to do is restart your phone. Hold down the power button and the volume up button, depending on your iPhone, swipe it to power off, power back on, and see if that ends up working. Chances are it might end up working, if that still doesn't work, then you want to double check the page that you're going to. Quadruple check that specific page, go to whatever website. If it's a random website that was like kind of like unknown, maybe that website isn't active anymore. There's a lot of things like that too. So probably keep your eye on that, but those are pretty much the main ways to fix it from my experience. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.